These people have helped shape and color our world. What do they have in common? Leonardo da Vinci, Sir Isaac Newton, Benjamin Franklin, Aristotle, Martin Luther King, Gandhi, Mozart, Darwin, Beethoven, Charlie Chaplin, Michelangelo, Nikola Tesla, Bobby Fischer, Steve Jobs, Jimi Hendrix, Mother Teresa, Helen Keller, Babe Ruth, Alexander the Great, Napoleon, Lenny Bruce, H.G. Wells, and probably one or more of your favorite actors, musicians, athletes, inventors, even politicians. They're all part of a very small minority that have made a tremendous impact while making up less than 10% of the world's population. They are in fact, or were, left-handed. And there's probably a lot more that we don't know about because they were made to look right-handed all throughout history. Most minorities are recognized by society. They've had lots of news coverage about them. Movies, documentaries, and even days of the year where we reflect and celebrate their experience and the difficulties they've had in order to fit in. And that's the correct thing to do. But the left-handed minority, or what I call the secret minority, have never had a comprehensive voice or any real media exposure about them. I propose to make a feature-length documentary film about one of the most unique and prolifically creative minorities in the world. I want to make a film about being left-handed. Let's face it, lefties have been demonized throughout history. Our religious texts or dictionaries have labeled lefties as bad, wrong, awkward, clumsy, evil. Even today, some people try to turn their children into right-handers when it's clear that they are naturally developing into left-handers. But despite this oppression, lefties have made tremendous contributions through all the activities that really make life worth living. Sports, science, art, music, invention, etc. In fact, without lefties like Nikola Tesla, there would be very little of modern society. No electricity, wireless communication, radios, fluorescent light bulbs, neon, wireless remote control, even Velcro. This is the kind of creativity I want to celebrate. A very special film about the pride and prejudice of being left-handed. One that will span six continents and travel from the origins of our outer life into the inner workings of our brains. I want to look into every culture, religion, and way of life and ask them what it's like being left-handed. I want to look into all the latest studies and find out more about why we are the way we are and how our uniqueness challenges or assists the very nature of our society. This film really does come at a time when there's a polarity between the way people view our world. We're really making choices about who we are and what we want to become. But this really is the perfect time for this film to be made. One of my favorite things is to try to find an idea that seems so obvious that it's kind of amazing that no one's ever done it before. I call it finding something between the cracks. This film has a built-in audience of close to 700 million people. That's roughly the population of the United States, Canada, Mexico, and Russia combined. Why it's never been made, I don't know, but I feel the time is now. I don't want this film to be an ego trip for lefties. We have our challenges just like everyone else. What I hope to do is share the experience of being left-handed with the world with other right brain people, and even people who can't relate to our experience, but after watching this film, we'll have a different viewpoint, a changed viewpoint. Unfortunately, this film will not be inexpensive. The travel alone, along with cameras, crew, visual effects, will make it more expensive than other truly low budget documentaries. But I know it will be worth it to gain points of view from people all over the world. This film is a milestone and a first of its kind. I want to see it wind up in theaters. So I need fellow Southpaws to come through and support this project. And like-minded, right-brained people who can see this vision and help me bring it to life. All of you out there who know what it's like to have everything in the world made for somebody else. From scissors to coffee cups to the arrow pointer on your screen right now. This film is dedicated to you and anyone else who celebrates creativity, invention, and excellence. I have a lot of experience directing. I'm also a photographer and musician. I have the skills to make a well-crafted, emotional, and intellectual journey that is both auditorily and visually striking. Considering the subject matter, it really has to be. I believe in this film, and they will truly have an impact on the world. I know that times are tough, and people don't have a lot of money, but this film is something that should have been made a long time ago, and the fact that it will be made now, in this way, is a testimony that its time has come. Lefties understand that they're a bit different from other people. They think a bit differently. Just being in a right-handed society has made it that way. But when no one else is around, they tend to confide that to one another. This film will be dedicated to those moments and will finally 
be able to share the experience of being left-handed with the world.